Hey, how's it going? I'm Mike Schepanik, and this is uh, day four of my five for five challenge. Um, so in my AP biology class today, we um, finally got to play the games um, that the kids have been working on for oh, a couple weeks now. Um, so New York State, uh, most uh, people have uh, are all done with school basically after AP exams come about, but not in New York State. We still have almost a month, so we're going to figure out some good things to do with them um, after the exam. So this year, one of the things I did is I, I found this um, this little uh, card set online, uh, I don't know, many months back, uh, about how to put take some create some games out of um, just everyday things. So here's some of the things that I did today. Um, so. I have these right over here, these sets of cards. So basically, let me show you the, this card set here is what's your game plan. And inside of it, there are various things like there's a game. And so for instance, this one is Mad Libs. I didn't really like that one so much, but um, here's for example, Trivial Pursuit, Apples to Apples, you get the idea. So they have a game. Um, they also have in here some cards that are uh, lesson cards. So for instance, this one is, you know, managing behavior in the classroom. Taking notes. Critical appreciation of an article. There's all sorts of different things. Problem solving, uh, finding sources, case studies, outlining, brainstorming, the list goes on. Um, and then we also have an action card. So we get trading. investigating, performing, and they say what they're doing here. For instance, this says interpreting a concept or experience through body language or nonverbal sounds. It kind of sounds like uh, charades to me or something like that. Um, and then lastly, they have um, the mechanic, game mechanic. So you have board spaces. Movement can be uh, can be made random or by choice. If random, try to design the game with more than one path to add decision making. Like, like Monopoly has a one path. Um, map or image. Roll cards. So what I did was I gave them each one of those four, each student, and I put them in groups of you know, four. So I gave them one lesson card, one game card, one action card, one mechanic card. Um, and then in groups of four, they got to pick which one they wanted to do. Um, no, I'm sorry, I didn't do that. I gave the group one, each one of those four. So they, they were kind of stuck with that. They could trade one of those cards in, but they could only trade in once and they didn't get to pick. So it was a random of what was left. Um, and then on top of that, what I did give them, this is the choice that I gave them, was um, AP Biology has several essential knowledge uh, things. Like for example, this one here, essential knowledge says uh, the interactions, can't read it backwards in there. Interactions between molecules affect their structure and function. Central Knowledge 4B1. So we have a whole bunch of these things that we do. So I gave them each one of these in the groups of four so that they had four of those cards and they got to pick which of the four they were going to address. So then give 20 minutes, brainstorm something, come up with an idea, you know, anything, you know, just brainstorm an idea. Um, and uh, they had some ideas, and then we started flushing them out. And today was the day they had to show their root, their rough draft of that. Um, and I also offered to buy the game. Um, we're going to go on to thegamecrafters.com, um, the winning team, which we decided was Biopoly today, the Biopoly game. And uh, they're going to then design the pieces, and it's going to be professionally done. Um, and I'm going to buy it, and it's going to have their name on it, and so that is their living legacy now to all the students after them. There were two young ladies that really spent a lot of time on that, um, did a really fantastic job. So, so that's a, you know another idea about uh, 
what's your game plan and uh, putting together all of these into design having students design the game the mini game so all right thanks uh, again thanks for watching I appreciate uh, you uh, sticking with me uh, through day four one day to go have a great day